Hello YouTube, it's your girl Free and I am back for my lock update. Let's see, what month am I on? I don't even know. I'm on August was a year. So that's 16 month lock update. <laughs> 16 month lock update. I haven't done it in a while because after the baby I've been having some postpartum hair loss and I just kind of really been embarrassed <laughs> to even make a video because all the progress that I made on my edges, it kind of just fell out after I had the baby due to postpartum, you know, hair loss. And it's real. I'm sure um, most of my viewers or that watch my videos uh, consistently know that that area is struggling. <laughs> so... And after the baby, I made so much progress using the Fertilizer Temple Balm by ORS and the uh, Rosemary Essential Oil. And I made really good progress. It was growing back. And then after the baby, with the baby, it was growing, taking the vitamins, it was growing. After the baby, it just fell out. Like, the temples right here was bald. Like, one just, I had to cut one off because it was starting to hang on by little strings and I just cut it out and it was like completely bald right here. Now it's growing back so you can see a little bit of the hair is coming in. This was always thin but I actually had hair right here and it was completely bald like I was on the verge of just cutting everything off just doing a buzz cut but then I thought about it and like since I didn't have any hair on this side is even worse this side is falling out now this side fell out first after the baby and then this side started falling out recently so i thought about if i just shave the sides off and just keep it like the mohawk look it still would look patchy so i couldn't really do that um <clears throat> couldn't basically this was my only option and i i don't think the dreads helped much because it was so thin already so when i locked my hair i think it started pulling more as it started locking like fully. I don't know if it was from my last retwist or due to postpartum, but after my last retwist and after I had the baby, everything was just history. <laughs> All of my progress was just gone. So I've been going through it, you know, trying to figure out what to do. I made another appointment to see the dermatologist, you know, to reconsider, uh, the hair transplant again and or I even just thought about just shaving it the size bald. I'm not sure how that will look if you know start to grow back and the hair right here doesn't grow at all. It's still gonna look patchy. So I'm trying to figure out what to do. Um, if you have any suggestions, you know, leave it in the comment section. What do you think I should do? I don't think these are helping my edges. The locks are helping my edges. I don't want to get rid of them completely because I can't wear sew-ins because obviously ain't gonna nothing, nothing's going to catch right there. I can't wear um, lace fronts because there's no hair. And what is it going to glue on my forehead? <laughs> um, this was like my only option. And I did this because I was tired of covering and hiding my edges, honestly. And I just wanted to be free. And this was my form of freedom. So I am happy with them. It's just that I'm not happy with what's going on with my edges and after the baby. And I just don't know what to do at this point. Um, I can't comb them out because if I comb them out, I already know. I ain't going to have no hair. I don't know how them people doing it on YouTube. I've seen a couple of videos. <clears throat> Natural Nirvana or in Black Hair Compass. I don't know her name, but... They comb out their hair. They have beautiful, luscious, thick hair. If I comb out this, it's history. I ain't having no hair. Like, <laughs> I'm going to be bald and it's going to be shriveled all up and whatnot. Because I had to comb out one on this side that was hanging hanging on some by some, some thread by a couple strands. And I took out one that was here. This was way thicker, but it's falling out every day. So combing out is not an option to me. I know that's a trend on YouTube, but that's not an option for me because I'm not going to have any more hair. So that's out of the question. Um, I don't want to comb out. Uh, I am considering cutting the side just because there's no hair. Like So... 
So I've seen uh, people that struggle with alopecia as well just cut off the sides completely bald. So I thought about doing that, but I don't know if that would be professional at work, you know. So I'm still weighing my options right now and I haven't made a video, a lock update because my baby's been, been sick these four months. The baby kept me busy and I've been struggling in this area with postpartum hair loss, postpartum depression. It's just been a crazy ride, but everything's getting better now. The baby's getting older. Um, he caught his first cold if you watched the previous video. Um, so we've been taking care of that and working on that. So right now I'm just in a stage with my hair. Having a uh, postpartum depression, I just was about to have a Britney Spears moment. And just eh, everything gone. <laughs> but uh, I didn't do that. So I'm still keeping them. I don't know what I'm going to do if I'm going to shape the sides. Every day I'm in there with the scissors like, I'm going to do it, Dre. Talking to my husband like, I'm going to do it. And I never do it, but because I'm just, I, this is the only way that I can wear my hair. Like, I wish that I could like flip it over or like do something like this, but I can't because I have to hide it, you know? So, um, yeah, if you have any suggestions, put them in the comment section. Uh, for those of you that continue to watch my videos and have been following my lab journey, Thank you for those of you that are new to my channel and follow me because of my lock journey. You know, thank you. Um, I'm still on this journey. I'm just not quite sure uh, what to do. I do like my locks. It's just that I can wear one style, one style only. I mean, I can wear headbands and all that, but I just really want my edges to grow. And this going into 2018, I should feel like nobody really has edges, you know, <laughs> but it's still an insecurity that I struggle with. So we'll see in a couple of months what I decide to do. Um, for now, I'm keeping my locks, but I am strongly considering shaving off the sides because there's nothing there. <laughs> so that's all for now. I know it's a quick video. I'm still moisturizing my scalp with a uh, rose water and vitamin E oil and uh, basically those are the only two <laughs> uh, right now. I just haven't had a retwist in like three three months or so because I haven't I didn't want to do anything at all. Uh, I'm still washing my hair with the clarifying uh, clear shampoo. I think that's by ORS too. Yeah. Um, and that's about it. So have any suggestions or recommendations or what you think about these things leave them in the comment section I need to wash my hair like right now and I would say that they are fully locked at this point Good night.